Hello everyone, uh, welcome to the demo of Nakivo Backup and Replication. Today we will learn how to backup with Nakivo to Amazon, to Amazon EC2. Uh, first of all we need to establish configuration and connection with Amazon and with Nakivo Backup and Replication it's all single click, all very easy. So you just go here to configuration on the top and click on the cloud integration on the left. And to establish connection with Amazon we have to click New Cloud Integration. Assuming you already have an EC2 instance at the Amazon, it just takes uh, one step here with Nakivo software uh, to establish an Amazon repository there. So first of all provide the name. Let it be Amazon Repository 1. And after creating EC2 instance at the Amazon, you should download some security keys, which I have to save in my notepad. I'm just going to copy paste. I select the region where my EC2 server is situated, and the minimum storage, which I want to preserve, let's say 10, just for the matter of this demo and as you see all the backups in the cloud will be compressed and deduplicated. On the right side here there is a little plugin which will help you to estimate how much you will end up paying for Amazon so we don't charge anything for Amazon, you deal directly with Amazon, you pay directly to Amazon but this little plugin will help you to understand how much you will end up paying. And we click add so the Amazon repository will now be created it goes through some processes there and we don't have to interact, it's all automatic so it usually takes uh, from uh, 10 to 12 minutes so let's wait till the Amazon repository will be configured alright so our Amazon repository has been configured I'm exiting the configuration and I'm ready to create the first backup job to Amazon so I go to create, select backup uh, the steps are just the same as for creating a local backup job. Let me select a small Ubuntu server VM. Uh, on the backup repositories, on the second step, I have Amazon repository available now. So I'm selecting it. Next, I'll let this job run on demand. I will call it Amazon Backup and I will not select any of the options here and store let's say 30 recovery points finish my Amazon backup job has been created I click run job and the job has been launched so basically 12 minutes and you have your Amazon connection configured by just clicking uh, two or three buttons and uh, now you're able to back up directly to the EC2 instance. So this is pretty fast, simple and amazing. Thank you.